else, everybody? It's me, Jay. It's back again for another review. This time we are looking at from the Marvel Universe line in House of M, Spider-Man. Now let's take a quick look at Spider-Man here. And this is the costume Spider-Man wore during the whole House of M craziness. And like I said, I do dig this costume look. I really do like it. I think it's very nice. And I like the way they did the whole spider emblem on his chest. Kind of goes into the back. Very cool. Very nice. I really do like it. So yeah, there's no classic little black spider in the front. It's just basically here and back here. And it travels all very nicely. Travels the pattern very well. And yeah, the red is pretty cool. And, you know, it's red. What can you say? But I do like the head sculpt. The head sculpt is pretty cool. Definitely has the classic wide-eyed Spider-Man mask look. Very cool. And the nice black paint around the eyes is pretty cool. It's a bit messed up on this side. And this is definitely one of those figures that's definitely hard to find, you know, perfect black outline eyes. I had to go through a, lo a lot of these figures to try to find one that looked nice. But anyways, getting off topic. Uh, as you can see, the rest of him is... Painted in blue, but it also has a bit of, uh, I want to say there's black in the blue. It's kind of got this, I don't know, weird coloring in it. As well as some black outlining and shadowing on the figure itself. So there you go. To the back, his butt and whatnot. So yeah, uh, the House of M Spider-Man in terms of the look of the figure. And again, he's slender. So that's Spider-Man should be, I think. He's a pretty nifty figure, I do have to say. Alright, Spider-Man here, his articulation, his head can turn all the way around, as you can see. His head can't really go down, can go up a bit, and that's pretty much it. And side to side if you want. Arms can rotate all the way around, go out and in, single jointed elbow. And the wrists rotate. Alright. The chest area. Very flexible. On the upper torso. And legs. They're on a ball joint so they go forward a bit. Not not back at, at all as you can see. It's got a double hinge. Knee. And foot can rotate all the way around. And go forward and back a bit. And here we have his accessories. I can see you have the stand. It says Marvel in black. It says Spider-Man number one. So there you go. And he's got this weird ass web shot, web slinging. I don't even know. It's just very tangled up mess. It is nice. It does look looks pretty cool. It does look cool. And then he's got this backpack that has his shoes. It's a shirt and, and a camera. The thing is, I think these were released before, I think, like, the first wave of Marvel Legends with the first Spider-Man that came out. I think these were with him. And, I don't know. Definitely, because in House of M, he wasn't a photographer. He was pretty much a suit. He was a, he was a professional wrestler slash movie star. So, you know, I would... I think he will have some other cool stuff that he will come with, like a championship belt or like, I don't know, something pretty cool looking. But they're alright. So, yeah. So here's Spider Man with all his accessories on. So, yep, backpack, funky web shot thing. Mmm, yeah. Not digging it really. So, overall, House of Ends Spider Man. I really do like the figure. I think it's pretty cool. I do like the, again, this costume in particular is pretty cool. One of my, not one of my top favorites, but it's definitely, definitely a likable costume. I really do dig it. Um, articulation, pretty good. No really complaints. Kind of wish his hands were kind of sculpted with the whole classic, you know, if I zoom out here, you know, with my meaty hands, you know, the whole classic. Swip pose, you know, to you know, shoot the webs and whatnot, but still 
pretty pretty cool. Uh, these things, again, they're nice, but I just really doesn't go with this particular Spider-Man. Um, again, he was a he's he was he's famous in House of M. Everyone loves him. I think he would come with better accessories. But what can you do? So. Uh, again, this is another Marvel Universe figure I would recommend. Definitely, definitely pick this up if you see him. Hopefully you enjoyed this review. I am Jay Asante with House of M Spider-Man and I'll talk to you all later.